Good morning, students. Are you done with today's homework? Very good. So, can you anyone step up into podium and explain? Here is the fun part starts. Having butterflies in that little stomach, most of the students turn their face towards a girl so that she would be pointed out. As no option left with that girl, she would answer every time. When you come across a situation, what kind of student you are? I was among one of those pointing others or else we do looking right, left, and then down. It goes on. We don't give a try unless we are pushed into the situation. Good morning, fellow Toastmasters and dear guests. This is Shanmukhi. I'm pursuing CA final and CMA final. I was brought up in Guruvada in Krishna district of Andhra Pradesh. My parents have an adorable daughter, and that is me. We are a family of four. I have an younger brother, his name is Dilip. I'm lucky that we are more like friends than siblings. I always wonder why I'm not comfortable, why I'm afraid of speaking with audience and strangers. After doing rigorous R&D, I found out one thing, that I have atelophobia. Yeah, you heard it right. Atelophobia means fear of making mistakes and fear of imperfection. To my surprise, I had this fear solely in respect of communication. For remaining things, I never felt this fear in schooling. Like I actively participated in sports, NCC training, uh, camps, everything along with my studies. And I always used it to be in the class toppers list. However, I was not the one who can communicate fearlessly with the audience, especially with strangers. I tend to keep quiet with fear of making mistakes. Although a humorous and talkative person, I always confine myself to my comfort zone, that is my family and friends. I never stepped out of it, but this non-interaction made my atelophobia even more severe. And in the long run, it made me out of practice of communication with people out of my comfort zone. So I strongly decided to step out of my native place to Chennai for doing CA articleship. I realized how important the communication is. And it's a basic life skill. So I want to improve it. And I came to Chennai. It was very hard to handle those initial days. Still, I started breaking those fears with practice. Practice, practice of interaction with colleagues, juniors, classmates, particularly with people out of my, uh, particularly from people with different kinds of backgrounds, helped me feel free to uh, communicate with people out of my comfort zone. And my seniors also encouraged me by giving suggestions and feedbacks. I was quite confident and have seen a good improvement in me. By God's grace, things are going smoothly. But in the middle, likewise the horror film The Mummy Returns. Recently, I have seen the traces of my fear in tabletop session of Toastmasters. When I came as a guest, my mind goes blank at that time. I felt I should focus on improving it. I should focus on improving it. And uh, I hope one day I'll do table, table topics with these and get at most satisfaction. I feel that I need improvement in some areas of communication. So I joined Chennai Speakers Forum because it is supportive and have coordinated club members. And a friendly environment to flourish together. Actually, this icebreaker is my fear breaker because this is the first speech in my life and I think I did it without fear. Thank you for this opportunity and hope we could overcome our fears with courage and they, they would get vanished with the journey with CSR. Thank you, dear Mori.